Hello, in this video, I'll instruct you how to make a report using Detail Report. Detail Reports return a list of results from the database that are not aggregated. One row is returned for each record in the data source. Here we already have the structure of a data inquiry report. It includes the date, period, transaction reference, description, journal number, journal line number and base amount. These columns will be the outputs of the query definition form. To start with, select Detail Report from the Data Extraction group. Reference to the business unit from the filters. And choose the ledger table. Reference to the account code from the filters. Because we don't need to specify the accounting period, type all to skip this criterion. That's all for the filters. Next, we're going to select the outputs. Transaction date. Accounting period. Transaction reference. Description Journal Number Journal Line Number and Base Amount The order of selection will affect the display sequence of the output columns. Or you can use sorting to specify the sort order of the output items. To apply a sort order, right-click any item and select sorting. Order the output items into the correct sort order by dragging them above or below the other items. The number 1 indicates an item is sorted first, 2 indicates an item is sorted second, and so on. Finally, click OK to run the query. We have successfully extracted the data. However, the name of the report is duplicated. I'll show you how to fix this. Double click on the cell containing the formula to reopen the query definition form. Select the report style tab. There is a preview version which shows how your report looks like. Uncheck the output data item names to remove the header row. Click OK to apply changes. We have finished the lesson. See you next time.